today we're going to do some sea scallops for you. So uh, I'm going to show you how to prepare it, how quick and easy they are as well. So one of the things you want to do when you get a sea scallop is that these are our dry sea scallops that we sell here. Um, is you want to pick off this little piece right here. This piece here, the little tail there, the little foot. It can get it can get pretty tough when you cook it. So I like to pick them off. They're edible, just a little chewy. So I like to get rid of them. And then I like to season with my salt and pepper blend here, pretty blended. Just a light, light sprinkle on both sides. I like to keep my scallops nice and simple. No sauces or anything, they're good just as is. We'll give a little oil to the pan here. You want your, you want your pan really nice and hot for this. Go ahead, lay them in there. Just be careful you don't splash yourself with the oil. And these are only going to take about 30 seconds to a minute on each side. Start putting some butter in the pan. A little extra flavor. You want to give it just enough time. You want a nice caramelization on both sides. So you want to get the, the scallop nice and brown. See this color starting to come on that. Which is why it's important to have a nice hot pan because you want that nice caramelization for flavor, but you also don't want it to take a long time because when it's sitting in the pan for a longer period of time, then you're going to have an overcooked tough scallop. And again, another 30 seconds to a minute on the other side. And if you want, serve it with a piece of lemon for a little extra flavor. Me personally, I like my scallops just with salt, pepper, and a little bit of butter in the pan. Sear it up. Delicious flavor as is. Another 10 seconds here, and I think they're about done. That's how I like 